So how are you enjoying being on this horror comedy series? Oh, I'm loving it. I don't, uh, it's fun to be around bl like brain splattering and, <laughs> and blood shooting uh, into the ceiling. Uh, it's been good fun. It's uh, like I, I, I mentioned earlier, I'm always, uh, always excited when I get to put on a uniform and uh, play someone in law enforcement. Um, it's not often that I get to have like a sense of authority. Uh, so that's a good treat. And, uh, and we shot this in, uh, in, in, in sunny, uh, hot Atlanta. <laughs> and that was good fun. It was great to be in Atlanta. Uh, I'm, I can't wait to see it tonight. This will be my first time. I'll see, it, see the show tonight. Well, I can't wait for it to premiere on November 2nd on November IFC. November 2nd on IFC, that's right. And I overheard them say that you went to Iowa State. That's right. I'm a cyclone. I'm a cyclone. I went too. All right! <laughs> Do you have to go to any of the alumni stuff that we have? Oh, no. I mean, I, I, are you from Iowa? Yeah, I'm from Davenport, Iowa. Where okay, I'm from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Oh, my God. I have family on So I, did, I made the, the seven-hour drive out to Ames oh uh, for five years, and uh, that's where I started to do theater. I, I, t I, I was an engineering student because they've got a, a great, you know, it's a great, great engineering program and program. agricultural and, like, homesteading as well. Um, and uh, But I took a theater class for... For giggles, and uh, I, 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 it was a wonderful environment. Were you a triangle? I was not. No, no. Um, I, we, I, we would just go. You know, when there was. Uh, do they have Visha anymore? They closed it down. Oh my God! They went crazy and they shut it down. Yeah. Damn students. It used to be a big party. It was a fun I wasn't. Party. A, I, I, I never partook in the Greek festivities except for their parties. Did you ever do the boat thing for the engineering students for Visha? Never did. No. Did no. Oh unfortunately, no. Never did. Um, I'm sure at the time uh, we were doing a sketch comedy show at the maintenance shop. So I'm sure um, there were a couple of v two vishas that I was uh, acting with that. We were uh, organizing a, a, an evening of sketch comedy for everybody. So I, I had no, no time for boat building. Oh my God. Well, back to the show. Yeah, yeah. So I had to, got to share that little It's so weird. I mean, I asked you. Oh my God. We, so we can absolutely, like, this is the time of year we are showing up to campus and. It, it smells like manure because they've like that's what you do like it's a fall and you have to like you you put that on top of the fields and you turn it over but it's uh, this is what always that was the smell that always greeted me when I went back to when to campus. I, I was used to it. I'm from Iowa, so I'm yeah. totally fine. Yeah, <laughs> I bet you miss Iowa sweet corn. Absolutely. And the pork chops. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. The, the meat out here tastes so different than it does back home. It just doesn't taste I, I, yeah. good. I mean, I still eat it. Don't get me wrong. I'm, I'm just saying it doesn't taste good. There's <laughs> nothing like some Iowa pork chops. <laughs> there really is. No. <laughs> Everyone's looking at us like, weirdos, <laughs> Iowa weirdos. So I'm going to ask you three really fast questions about the show. Sure. What is your favorite horror comedy that inspired your role on the show, Stand Against Evil? Oh, um, you know, I... I my favorite horror comedy, without a doubt, is um, is American Werewolf in London, and I know it's a big influence for Dana, and it, it's a, it's a, on his list, and I I, I can see that in, in the show, and uh, and God bless him for it because yeah, that is a good time. Uh, the humor, the tension, the scares, the frights, the creatures, um, and, and and that's what we're tr you know trying to deliver a little bit here. So I, it's a good uh, good pedigree to follow. It looks like you guys get along really well. All the hugs, all the friendliness. You must yeah. have a really nice set. Absolutely, yeah. It was quick. We were there uh, five weeks. We we didn't we didn't waste any time um, delivering all these episodes for you. But uh, yeah, we had a great time, and um, and I, I yeah, I can't wait to get to hopefully do it, go and return and do this all again with those folks again. Final question: What's your favorite monster on the show? Um, you'll see it tonight, and it has <laughs> hooves and. Horns and um, probably wouldn't be too good on a plate, too bad on a plate either. So the pig monster. No, not the pig tonight. There's a there's a, a goat tonight. It's the band. Oh. And, um, um, it features pretty predominantly in the episode, second episode, and yeah, I'm partial to uh, the uh, animal actors that we had on set. <laughs> really? Uh, yeah. Good eating. Big fan of their work. <laughs> Thank you so much for talking Thank to you. me. And oh my God, go a cyclone. Iowa. So I'm nice going to do a quick photo with you. Sure. When did you graduate? Uh, 95. I was there. Well, I graduated in 92, so we missed each other. When I was probably there. I, I slacked out. I slacked out for a long time, so I was chilling at school. Way too long. Did you go to George's uh, BBQ? You know George's? Remember that place? Mm, I don't think oh, it was no, open battles, when I was there. Battles Barbecue? 
No, Burbank. I yeah, no, there was the best food in Maine. You missed really? it. Yeah. Do you remember that square pizza place? Uh, there's a square pizza place on the main. Doughboys, remember Doughboys? The cookie shop. What was People's People's Bar and Grill on the corner? Was that that I remember, but I remember I the remember cookie Doughboys. shop. It was like Doughboys. It was on the main strip. They had like snickerdoodles. That was like my me and my. Did you go to Size Roost. Do you remember that bar? Was that the base one in the basement? Yeah. Yes, my some white guy tried to pick me and my friend up. He had a black friend, and so they said in the case of racial harm. You guys should sleep with us. And my friend was super drunk and she was like, well, I don't want to see braces, so I guess I'll sleep with black. I don't want to know.